नमस्ते वेलकम टू द यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ ऑक्टेव्स ऑनलाइन एज यू अकम्पनी वोकल म्यूजिक तीन ताल इन मध्य लय इज अ वेरी कॉमनली यूज ताल फॉर द छोटा ख्याल कॉम्पोजिशंस ऑफ एनी राग सो वेन यू अकम्पनी द वोकलिस्ट देर आर सर्टन थिंग्स यू मस्ट कीप इन माइंड दैट योर ठेका हैज टू बी वेरी क्लियर सो दैट द सिंगर द वोकलिस्ट और इफ यू आर अकम्पनिंग एन इंस्ट्रूमेंट प्लेयर द इंस्ट्रूमेंट प्लेयर शुड बी अवेयर ऑफ वेयर एग्जैक्टली विच बीट एग्जैक्टली इन द ताल साइकिल दे आर ऑन एट एनी पर्टिकुलर टाइम सो योर ठेका मस्ट बी वेरी क्लियर नाउ हाउ टू मेक द ठेका क्लियर देर आर सर्टन गाइडलाइंस that you can follow and then of course with experience and listening to good tabla players accompanying you will learn more and more about how to play good theka or accompaniment but the basic guidelines are with the help of emphasis you can make the theka sound very nice and easy to sing with or play with for other artists the sum as i said is the most important point in the taal cycle so whatever improvisations you do as a tabla accompanist or the vocalist is doing they are all aimed to land on the sum or conclude on the sum so the sum is the point of highest emphasis the next point of emphasis is the beginning of sections and then the khali should be very clear and distinct because that is what separates the third section of teen tal from the first two so let me repeat highest emphasis on the sum then emphasis on the beginning of sections and clarity in khali so that it is very easy to distinguish between dha tin tin dha and dha tin tin dha if that is not clear it would lead to confusion about which section of teen tal you are in at any particular moment for example if you just play da din din da da din din da da din din da da din din da without showing the khali it would be very difficult to keep a track of the 16 beat cycle because you may not be sure about whether you are on the first section or the second or third or fourth so the distinct shape or the specific shape of the teen tal cycle is formed with the help of khali so you must show the khali very clearly and with emphasis so ta din din ta 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 ta now how do you emphasize on the sum or the beginning of the sections or how do you show the khali in a distinct way so the emphasis could be done at least by two ways number 1 by sound dynamics so you can play the note louder than the rest of the notes the second is by modulation of the dagga for example as pressure of the wrist would give you different tones on the dagga so you may apply or use the pressure of the wrist to create emphasis on a particular note for example so watch that i am playing the sum louder and with pressure of wrist that creates an emphasis on the sum and thereby makes it very clear to the listener that this is the beginning of the cycle watch again so the emphasis is created by playing the note a little louder and with modulation of the dagga now how to create the contrast between the khali and bhari or khali and the other sections of teen tal cycle so as to make it clear about the third section so the answer is the contrast now how to increase the contrast of bhari and khali or khali and the other sections by making other sections very predominantly bass and resonant 
how to make the contrast between khali and bhari clear by making the other sections resonant so that the base is very evident in other sections and the absence of base would make khali distinct in contrast what i mean is ta these two sections must be played with open bass and then the absence of bass would be felt in the third section that distinguishes the khali from the rest of the sections so summarize highest emphasis on the sum then on the beginning of each section and the khali should be shown in a distinct way the way to do that or to emphasize on a note is by playing it louder than the rest of notes as well as by modulation of pressure of the left, left hand wrist and the khali can be shown in a distinct way by keeping the other sections which are full of bass notes or bhari notes resonant so that the absence of bass is felt in the third section of khali and it appears distinct in contrast apart from this there is one more way of emphasizing on the sum which is by creating a hype towards the sum or creating a build up towards the sum in the last few beats of the tal maybe the last 4 beats or 8 beats if you play a small piece that leads to the sum it creates a build up and thereby emphasizes or highlights the sum even more for example the tihai that you can play in the last 4 beats just tirakit dha tirakit dha tirakit dha so if you are going dha then then dha dha then then dha dha then then ta tirakit dha tirakit dha tirakit dha so there you create a build up or a hype or emphasis to the sum watch that da den den da da den den da da den den da tere ke tha tere ke tha tere ke tha den den da again it does not have to be a tihai do tihai is a good way of creating a build up to the sum it could be a small piece which is called a mukhda in the tabla language so mukhda is a small piece that you play towards the end of the cycle it could be 4 or 8 beats long or maybe it is definitely smaller than the tal's cycle and it is played towards the end of the cycle leading to the sum so that it creates an emphasis on the sum again for example da den den da da den den da da ten ten ta ti ta ta ti de ki ta ka ti de ki ta so i am playing the mukda or the phrase in the last four beats as ti ta ta ti de ki ta ta ka ti de ki ta da watch that again da den den da da den den da da ten ten ta ti ta ta ti de ki ta ta ka ti de ki ta da again da den den da da den den da da tin tin ta tit ta ta tere kit ta tere kit ta let me play that da den den da da den den da da tin tin ta tit ta ta tere kit ta tere kit ta Let's look at the mo the mukda or the phrase separately. It is tit ta ti ra kit ta ka ti ra kit. So it is four beats. Tit ta ti ra kit ta ka ti ra kit da. Again, tit ta ti ra kit ta ka ti ra kit da. Tit ta ti ra kit ta ka ti ra kit da. Okay. Watch how to play it. Tit ta ti ra kit ta ka ti ra kit da. Again. ta ti ta ki ta ta ka ti ta ki ta ta again ti ta ta ti ta ki ta ta ka ti ta ki ta ta so in the teen tal cycle ta den den ta ta den den ta ta ten ten ta ti 
You may want to play a longer mukhda with a tihai like dha den den dha dha den den dha tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha den den dha dha den den dha tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha so this starts on the khali or the ninth beat and goes like tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha so there is a small dhai at the end of this tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha and dhati dha and dhati dha watch again dha den den dha dha den den dha tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha den den dha dha den den dha tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha that leads to a very popular tukda which is played with kathak dance as well as can be played while you are accompanying a vocalist it's a tukda for teen taal it goes like dhati 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 dha tere kit tak ta tere kit tak tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha so it begins on the sum and ends on the sum as well so dhati 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 dha tere kit tak ta tere kit tak tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha watch again dhati 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 dha tere kit tak ta tere kit tak tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha so to understand this tukda step by step let us break it into three parts the first part or the body of the tukda the second part or the bridge and in the third part tihai so body bridge and tihai these are the three parts in most of the tukdas of tabla the body for this tukda is dhati 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 tak kit tak ta tak kit tak okay so watch that again dhati and dhati and dhati so there is and which is a gap after the first two dhatis but the third dhati is not followed by a gap so dhati 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 rakita tak ta ti rakita tak again watch that there is no gap after the third dhati whereas first two dhatis are followed by a gap so dhati 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 rakita tak ta ti rakita tak that's the body then the bridge ti rakita tak ta ti rakita okay tirakita takata tirakita again tirakita takata tirakita that's the bridge leads to the tihai which is dhati dha and dhati dha and dhati dha so the three parts together body bridge and the tihai dhati 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 dha tirakita takata tirakita tak tirakita takata tirakita dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha if you want to do an exercise which is a little more advanced try to play the theka of teen taal on the tabla as you recite this tukda for example dhati 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 tere kit tak ta tere kit tak tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha this is a very good quality of a tabla player if you can do it if you can play the theka on the tabla and recite a composition be it tukda chakradhar or kaida or any composition along with the theka on the tabla you would understand the intricacies of the composition much better and you would also be able to play the theka as almost a subconscious process which is very essential when you are accompanying a vocalist because you need to keep playing the theka and listen and appreciate what the vocalist is doing or the instrument player is playing and then plan and play something that would complement their music so coming back to the tukda dhati 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 dha tere kit tak ta tere kit tak tere kit tak ta tere kit dhati dha 
dhati dha dhati dha let me play it once and then we will play it step by step in parts so that you know how to play it as well dhati 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 so the first part dhati and dhati and dhati 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 watch again the first two dhati is followed by a gap third dhati no gap dhati 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 okay dhati 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 the bridge dhati 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 so when you start that phrase play it with emphasis so dha dhati 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 so watch the points of emphasis again the beginning dhati 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 now dhati 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 those three dhas of the high are very important too you must emphasize on the dha the landing dhas of the tihai phrase like dhati dha dhati dha dhati dha so that it sounds more like a tihai a phrase repeated three times and landing on the sum so the whole tukda again dhati 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 Please subscribe to the YouTube channel of Octaves Online for more videos.